Hi folks, Tony here with TNT RVing and today I wanted to show you how easy it is to remove your cabinet drawers. Sometimes it's necessary to pull them out so you can take a look at what's behind them. Whether it's plumbing or electrical or heating duct or what have you. So I wanted to share this with you. Hopefully it's helpful. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to TNT RVing. We're slowly growing and we need your support. So let me bring you in a little closer and show you how to remove the cabinet drawers. Alrighty, so we're gonna open up the drawer. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at this little lever here. And the lever on this side is actually closer to the lower part of this track. What you're gonna do is lift up on this lever and on the opposite track, you're gonna go in the opposite direction. So we're gonna lift up on the left side and we're gonna push down on the right side. And then we're just gonna simply pull it out. And there you could get a little better look at how the mechanism is. And when you're lifting up, you're just lifting that up past the stop that's in the, this part and it allows you to pull it out. So it's nice as you can just pull it out like so. Alrighty, so having the cabinet drawer out sometimes is helpful uh, for doing some inspecting, see what's going on back there. And as you can see, we have the cable television for outside, it's power and the cable itself, wiring and some ducting. Uh, I, I like to pull these out and just inspect it periodically. Also, uh, some of the cabinets are not really well supported. Fortunately, this one is. This has some pretty good screws that are holding the track in uh, on either side, and the support looks pretty decent. We haven't had any issues with this, so we're pretty fortunate. But uh, So that's essentially why I wanted to show you how to remove these drawers. I saw on Facebook somebody was questioning it. I decided might as well create a uh, little video on how to remove them. So. And then, as you do to reinstall these, is align the right side and the left side and push it in. And what you'll do, you'll hear it click like so. And that's how simple that is. So, hopefully, this video is helpful. And if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to TNT RVing. We're slowly growing and we need the support of our subscribers. Thanks for watching. And as Tina would say, we'll see you at the campground.